Hi again, everyone. I'm Pastor Tom of the Ithaca Church of God. The great theologian and pastor Dietrich Bonhoeffer, before he passed many years ago, he once said about the church that the church is the church only when it exists for others, not dominating, but helping and serving. I love that quote. I've always loved that quote because it's something that I've resonated with throughout my years of ministry. At the Ithaca Church of God, our core values are loving God, loving others, and loving our community. And really, that's that's the whole thought of what Dietrich Bonhoeffer was saying, that the church really exists to love. And so at the church, the Ithaca Church of God, we have um, always made it our goal to serve our community and then as we can to reach out beyond our community to serve other communities to serve our state um, and even the world as we can but we start with our own community and the primary way that we make that possible is through something called Faith Promise Sunday this coming Sunday, October the 3rd, is our Faith Promise Sunday. And what a Faith Promise is, is people in faith pledge that they're going to give a monthly financial amount to help our church in all the ways that we serve the community and even the world. Now this pledge is made as a as a a faith step with God where a person is saying what amount do I believe God will give me extra each month that I can give to help others a person prays about that amount it might be something that they feel might be a small amount or it might be a very large amount but it's it's whatever they believe that God is going to give them extra each month. It's a wonderful thing. It's a beautiful thing to see how that extra amount of money just comes in and it's, it's kind of like a monthly um, just faith journey to see how God's going to come through. But people on Faith Promise Sunday promise a certain amount of money and, and then they trust that God's going to give it to them. And if for whatever reason and I don't believe this will happen, but if God wouldn't come through, then they don't, they don't give. But God does come through when we trust him for that extra amount. And that extra amount is, is money over and above what people already give to the church for the things that we're doing. So it's called a faith promise pledge. And that happens this coming Sunday, October the 3rd at 10.30. Let me tell you just some of the things that uh, we are we are going to be doing with that money that comes in this year, and um, we'll be talking about these ministries more on Sunday. But some of the things that we do is we help the Ithaca Food Pantry with those funds that come in. We help the Lansing Rescue Mission, which helps feed the homeless in Lansing. We help the Rural Bible Ministry. If some of you are from the Ithaca area, you know and remember Uncle Bob and his ministries to the, um, the uh, school-age children of our community. Um, Hope House Ministry of Gratiot County is a ministry that we support each year with our faith promise giving, and this is a ministry that helps find a temporary shelter for the homeless in our county. The Habitat for Humanity we also support. We actually were able as a congregation to team up with Habitat for Humanity and build a house in the Ithaca area for um, a, a family in, in this area and they now have a, a brand new home because of faith promise giving and 
because of our help with Habitat for Humanity. And we are going to help out Habitat for Humanity once again in building another house, not in the Ithaca area, but in the, uh, the general area here of Ithaca. And we're going to be part of that. Also, we help the teachers of um, Ithaca. We, we have a teacher's appreciation lunch and we do other things for teachers as well during the year and also for the students and all of that comes from our faith promise giving. We also um, help out a wonderful ministry couple that's in West Africa and the ministries that they do. Uh, one other family that we help is a couple that ministers to Native Americans here in the United States. So lots of ways that we will be using the money again this year for Faith Promise. And I just encourage you to be there on Sunday morning, October the 3rd at 1030. And uh, just be thinking in advance what it is uh, that God wants you to give in terms of a faith promise gift. I look forward to Sunday. We'll see you then.